JR, we have time maybe for one more question to talk about it. Um, because you've been actively involved in this awakening as you have over the last 30 years, and from your particular perspective, where do you see that we are now and what is the f prospect for the future in terms of this spiritualization or re spiritualization that's going on? Well, I, there's a couple ways I look at it, and they, and they will seem contradictory and inconsistent, but I think that's what's going on. For the, for the most part, we don't seem to be evolving. If so, why aren't we building pyramids in Giza? Like, you know, uh, why aren't we not further ahead than we were a few years ago? One answer to that is we've learned better ways to detect what's wrong, and so therefore we have more wrongness working than before. And when you get more wrongness, you get more opportunity for rightness. And I think the rightness starts to pull the positive energy fields in. More people on the planet with more rightness percentage-wise is going to start to produce more health. But to produce health, you've got to pr get rid of toxicity. So where does it go? It's thrown up in the air around us, and there's more diseases in and around our bodies than there used to be 200 years ago, 100 years ago. And there's going to be a lot more. So two things are happening. We're either destroying or we're being prepared for a translation to a new vibration. I don't think God can destroy himself, and we're all part of that. So I think he's getting ready to translate in new energy fields. How are they going to come? individually for each person according to how they can accept it because he's never given anybody anything they couldn't handle. He'll take you up to the top and see how you do <laughs> and you may say off for a few days uh, but he'll never give you something to do that he doesn't give you the ability to do it with too and if not he will have you nearby where somebody has the ability if you'll turn and ask him which is still part of asking God. And I think one way we're going to get it is by prayer and by sitting and asking God to come in and pray with us for what we in this particular body needs, and those will be answered. So we are definitely in a tra at a crucial transition point here? No, no more crucial than any, any other time. Than any other time. It's just, this is just what's going on. It's just what's going on, yeah. <laughs> Got it. John Roger, thank you so much for being with us.